Hey folks, how you doing? How have you been? Leducium here playing some more Dark Souls 2. We're playing the DLC and we are getting our asses handed to us against this boss here. So I'm going to summon some help and hopefully we can do a bit better. Uh, I can't and I won't. If you watched the last video, blame any of the help I've summoned. Everyone's been great. I've just been doing poorly. I've been targeted by the boss. He's kind of seems to be coming after me exclusively. Uh, and it's a pain in the ass. Hoping uh, we'll do better this time. So now I know to kind of stay away from him a bit more. And I need to learn to dodge his attacks. A bit better. Hello. We. Hi. This way. All right. So let's see how we do. We've got hundreds. We've got Adam. Huge, large. All right. And uh. And we're off. So I'm. Equipment wise, I'm pretty much prepared. We've got two sun bros here. Yeah. Lesson to be learned. One, stay away from the boss. Two, stay the fuck away from the boss. And three, stay very far away from the boss. Uh, ring of steel protection. I mean, this is pretty much all I can do. I have the right rings. I, I'm doing as well as possible. Alright. Of course, of course, pyromancer first. Maybe I can't backstab these guys. Like, maybe I never could, is what I'm trying to get at. I don't know why I thought I could at one point. Stop chasing after me. Let me drink. That repair powder is going to screw me up, isn't it? Alright, Pyromancer. Sorry. You're going to have to get killed. Shit! No! That's how I die. Shit! Get out of there. Okay, good. Heal. And let's make sure our knights don't die and we pick up the items, whatever. Moist leggings, there we go. Just to get more stuff. Shit. Alright, slightly one less dude to worry about. We're getting tons of souls. Like, this is a great place to just soul farm if I really wanted to. I don't, but, you know, if I did, this would be it. Alright, here comes, what's his face? So we'll get repaired up, we'll heal up. Should probably break out the life gems at this point. Uh, you know what? Strong magic shield up. I wonder if I can get him to fall off the edge like he did with the other guy. No, it's not a pyromancer this time. Alright. Why is everyone suddenly over here? Why am I so fucking interesting? Alright, good. That guy's dead. Adam Huge Large is hurt. Don't get killed. Back away and heal if you need to. Wow. We'll just stick to hitting you with conventional weapons. That Was he aiming for me? I think he was. That seems personal. Alright, well, we're going to try this again. He seems to go after me a lot. Uh, but... Alright, I'm just going to work on... Concentrate on dodging. 
Hopefully Adam can heal. Alright, I think he's done with me for a second here. So we can get a hidden and then back to sword and dodge mode. Now he's, yep, he's pissed at me. So we back away. So I like that attack. I know how to dodge that one relatively well. I hope he keeps doing that. Do one of these and back to dodging. Oh shit! All right. Good. Heal up. Give me a second here. He's gonna come after me. I know it. He's almost dead. There we go. That worked out wonderfully. Let's say huzzah, we got Soul of the Ivory King. That was a tough fight, but much better. Obviously than before. We And is this the crown or something? Crown of the Ivory King. Wonderful. Uh, I'm assuming I need to go towards the light and not the fire. It's a try close range battle. Yep. <clears throat> All right. So let's go back. That went way better than the last few times, but it's because you know learning and stuff. It helps. It helps if I learn. Uh, let's go see if you have anything new to say. I know. I killed him. So you've met like jealousy or something and other stuff and then this one's fear. Alright. Fair enough. So that's the soul that we picked up. What does that mean? Can I give you this thing? No. No, no, no. No, I 
don't think that'll do anything for me. All right, I have no idea. One minute ahead. That's true. Uh, is there anything in here that I might have missed? Can I go back down here? I think I can. Do I want to? I don't know. The old chaos. Apparently I can come back down here. Alright, and they come back out. It's good to know. Uh, so long, suckers. I don't want to fight him. Not three on one. Can I summon help? <laughs> so I think I can get souls from them. I probably need a certain amount. Maybe. I have no idea what's supposed to happen. Uh, but let's take a look at the stuff we did get. So. Let's go take a look at whose soul did we get? Squall King, Ivory King. Did we already look at that? No, we didn't. Soul of the Ivory King. Um, soul of the Ivory King of Eliam Lois. The proud Ivory King was ever merciful and devoted himself to the protection of his great land until he was devoured by the flames of chaos. The wondrous soul of this great king can be used to acquire numerous souls or to create something of great worth. So we'll have to go check that out. Also, we picked up the crown of the Ivory King. Crown of the Ivory King, who once ruled this land far to the north, a king built a great cathedral to appease the raging flame. But when he sensed the degradation of his soul, he left without a word, leaving everything to Alsana, who had unbeknownst found a place at his side. But these events of long ago... But these were events of long ago, and today no one even remembers the king's name. Uh, is it any good? That's yeah, pretty good, as far as crowns go. It's the lightest one out of all of them. Looks fine. Whatever. Uh, let's go check out what the what this soul actually will do for us if we trade it in for something. We'll go to Ornifex first. <coughs> Aha. There are no more. How are you still alive? I know I've killed you like ten times at least. But apparently I didn't. All right, fine. Kill you 11 times. And this thing's gone at least. Now, we need to converse. Converse, repair, nope. Okay, buy item. 29, we're doing fine. We're doing fine on fire arrows. Uh, let's go trade. So what do you give me for that soul? Uh, Defender Soul of Nishandra, Bride of Ash, Squalid Queen, the Slumbering Dragon, Iron King, Lostad, Ivory King. There we go. Ivory King Ultra Greatsword. Ultra Greatsword of the Ivory King of Eliam Lois wield bo with both hands to realize its full strength. It is said that the Ivory King was once the highest ranking knight. In his home of Ferosa, famed for its god of war, after taking his crown, they say he was the first to swing his sword in times of need, be it for his homeland or his people. And this other thing here, is it the same thing? Nope, that's the Fume Knight. Lost Sinner. Of the King's Pet. Oh, that's new. We didn't see this before. Sword of Fab Fab Fabian. Fabian? Fabian, Knight of Elim Lois. This blade, crafted with ivory ore, native to the land, harnesses souls 
to slash her foes. Sir Fabian led the loyal knights of Ilium Lois straight into the depth of chaos to exterminate the terrible things that dwelt there, but not one of the selfless knights returned. Huh. Interesting. So that's stuff that we have. So I don't know what to do next. I think I do know that if we go down here, expulsion chamber, there's like a side quest area from here. Yeah, because there's one more thing that we have to unlock. So if we go here and we get in the coffin, I guess there's an additional area that we can go to. Might as, well, might as well take a look and see. And then there's still the smelter demon. Oh good, I can't see Jack and shit. Uh, there's stuff this way. There's what looks like summon signs. Sigrim. Cancel. Abyss Fever. The hell? More summons. Head of Vengral. Are these all NPCs that I can summon? Whoa. Blizzard. Uh, let's summon somebody. I like Vengral. Sure. Abyss. Fever. Sure. And then I guess... Is there a bonfire somewhere, I guess, is another question. Let's head this way. So I have absolutely no idea where I'm supposed to go and this is not making my life any easier by me not being able to see a damn thing. There's an item, dried root. Now I'm covered in snow. There's what looks like another item. Oh, poop. Oh, they can back kick. The hell's that? And shoot lightning. So, magical snow horses. There's what looks like an item that I kind of missed. Mira hat. Cool. We'll look at it later on. Uh, I don't, don't think this is necessarily a safe place to be doing that. So, just keep going. What the hell? Is that a nice zombie? Lacerating knife? Oh shit, why can't I dodge out of the way of that? It does so much fucking damage. He kind of... The freaking horse tracks me. Fucking ice horse. Just kill it. Thank you. Uh, ice zombie, good. By good, I mean bad or terrible. I wonder if the ice zombie guides the way. So there's another building. There's no way to fucking dodge! So everyone, do you, everyone have lightning? This is just like the other fight where, uh, um, they just keep spawning. And there's no way to dodge them. The hell? Okay, maybe we'll be safer in the building. Or maybe there'll be items here. Ice zombies. 
at least a couple. Uh, Pharaoh's Lockstone. All right. Seems a little warmer in here at least. Uh, this seems like healing water, which actually should heal my NPCs, right? Come here. Well, one of you walked in there. Uh, how do I get you to come in here, Bengrel? Can you come in here, please? There you go. All right, let's try this again. At least that's going to be there. Uh, so there's more bodies and ruins that way. Oh, shit. You know what this reminds me of? Uh, from the first Dark Souls, the Manticore or whatever, the Chimera that we had to fight. Shit. I don't know whose lightning is whose, nor can I see the horse, nor anything else that's fucking going on. I think I see another horse out in the distance, though. I wish these guys would just follow me. And we could ignore that horse. Shit! Horse! Horse! <laughs> Alright, I think we have to fucking kill these guys. I can't just ignore them. Alright. You're dead, you're dead. You're gonna die. Uh, no idea what that is. Somebody's shooting darkness at me. Trying to just move on. These fucking horses. Man. Man, oh man. They're not making it simple. There's more dead people. Somebody's fucking shooting darkness. I don't know which of you assholes is doing it, but somebody's doing it. That looks like another horse up ahead. Shit. Okay. Let's be careful. I said, <laughs> let's be careful. Exact opposite of what happened. Exact opposite. Okay, I'm trying to get my sword out. And my sword's gonna fucking break. Before too long, who the f- Hmm. The hell is that? I don't know who you are. But you're not helping. In fact, you're probably hurting more than helping. At least they can do that. Whatever happened to a good fashion poise break a horse two horses Jesus and somebody is still shooting darkness at us Alright, am I any closer to the building I was heading to? I have no idea which building I was heading to. I am completely fucking lost. I think... 
Uh, now that I pick up these items, it's only going to make it worse. I think it was this building, though. So I think we did get closer. Then Grawl's injured. My sword's almost broke. Fucking horses everywhere. Ice Knights. Come on out. At least come out here. Is that another horse? The fuck is throwing lightning? Ah, man. Why is our making this any easier? She's got flasks. I don't think Van Grawl does. Anything in here that's of any use? No. Uh, is that... Did we come from there? Where are we going there? Okay, I'm just gonna go there. Shit. My freaking god, horses, stop these shenanigans. Uh, seriously, I hate these fucking horses so much. I'm out of Estus. Oh god, <laughs> he landed on me. Somehow. Oh, I see. That's where the lightning's coming from. Just casts it in the sky. Shit. You know what? Fuck it. I'm making a run for it. Fuck everyone. Goodbye. Seems like a place to go. I think. I see a staircase. Snow's dying down. Come on, everybody else. Let's go this way. Ignore the horses. Good. What do you know? My NPCs actually follow me instead of the horses. Oh shit, the horses followed us! It's all... <laughs> it's all come to a head. No! No! There was the boss. The horses followed us. Oh god. Ah, uh, shit. That was terrible. I found the boss. Basically I just followed the buildings, but... That was terrible. I wonder if there's another... Okay, well, we lost our weapons. One of our weapons. At least we lost the club. I don't think I could just outrun the horses. I think we'd... We'll be pursued and killed. I didn't like that one bit. <clears throat> Nope. It's crazy tough. <clears throat> so we're going to do something else. I'm going to go stock up on poison arrows first. Make sure I have a bunch. Uh, no reason not to. See, this is where my spells actually do half decent damage. Right about this point. And even then, in Dark Souls 1, these all of these would have been one shots. But that's fine. Just disappointing how shitty spells are in the DLC. 
I guess they don't want to make it too easy, but still. Like, compared to just physical attacks. Uh, buy item. This times, so oh, I don't know. That. This is also going to be useful in New Game Plus, so that's why I'm stocking up. Make sure if we do end up going to New Game Plus and I forget that I have plenty of stuff. You know what I didn't look at? Not that. But we did pick up some... Some Charred Lois Gauntlets and Charred Lois stuff. Charred Gauntlets of the Knights of Lois, burned black by flame. These Knights of Lois plunged into the old chaos with their lord and lost their sense of self. To this day, they still burn in agony alongside their once proud king. Yeah, that's a bummer. So let's go back. Let's try this one more time before I completely give up. I'm just going to make a run for it. I'm going to say fuck the horses. Pretty crazy how tough this area is. Alright, so we know... Is there a bonfire? I'm surprised that, that there isn't, because there should be. Uh, just because it seems like there's one in every area. So we have Abyss. Was the other summon here not an NPC? So we have... So there were three summons here, weren't there? So one of them must not have been an NPC. Huh. Well, isn't that cool? Oh, yeah, because these stones allow you to summon non-NPCs, too. Well, just so happens I only summoned NPCs by accident or on purpose. I don't know. I'm just kind of... Avoiding. Let's see if we go this way. There's a horsey. Shit. I jumped right at him. I don't think I can outrun him. Actually. You know what? That might be a bad idea. So is that. Oh, shit. It is a bad idea. I was hoping maybe I could just run along the edge of the map and avoid that but I'm sure they thought of that oh uh, well that sucks yeah I'm pretty sure I can't just I'm pretty sure I can't just outrun the horses otherwise it would be too easy in fact I know why the NPCs are there just like the smelter demon they're probably there to uh, help me get to the boss but then I'm kind of on my own against the boss and that sucks and I'm not looking forward to that same with this Iron Passage in the Smelter Demon area. But we'll handle that later on when we come back. Until then, folks, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please show your support. Leave a like. Hit subscribe if you haven't already. You get updates whenever I post new stuff. And as always, my name is Adusium. I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate you guys tuning in. And I'll see you guys next time. Later.